So we're with John from uh, West Coast Cleaning Supplies. What have you got for us today, John? Right, we've got uh, a graffiti remover, which is by a company called Zinsa, and actually made from soya beans, if you can believe it, but an incredible product and will get the majority of paints off of most. I'm sceptical, John. You're telling me this spray is going to take sort of uh, acrylic off? We came in this morning and the building next door had been graffiti. The uh, guys have come through on the weekend and tagged it. So then we've left that on there just for a minimal amount of time and always test the patch areas before we do it so that you don't uh, ruin the entire thing because sometimes the surface underneath can also be uh, removed yep. too. I see. Okay. Oh, you're joking. So, easy as that. Now, give that a little bit of a clean up that area with just a spray and wipe the uh, peerless active Yep. And you also carry that here too, John? We do. Yep. So you can see what it's done is it's liquefied that paint to be able to get it moved off. Uh, and you just need to give that a bit of a clean up so you don't spread that around. I can't believe it. But we'll do another section there. Look, you can see that is. It's on there, it's solid, it's not yeah. coming off. It's not just something that we've put on there ourselves. It's not a texture. It doesn't need a lot of time. Like I said, just test patch the area yep. to make sure that you don't remove what's underneath the substrate. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. So, so what sort of surfaces can we use this product on, John? It can be used on brick, wood, tile, metal, concrete, glass, vinyl siding. So okay. pretty much anything. Yep. Uh, brick and porous surfaces will probably need to have a couple of applications because the paint, uh, as a liquid, sinks in. Sinks into yep. it. So you do need to, to let it soak into it and remove it back out. It might take two or three goes, but uh, you know we've we've had brand new sheds, lovely cream coloured, big rotten graffiti all over them. The guys have come along, given it a blast with that, and for uh, you know a minimal investment amount. So what is it worth, John? Uh, it's fifteen ninety-five. Oh, that's a lot cheaper than repainting. You know, that sign there is probably worth five hundred dollars, maybe more. And I suppose if you just repainted the sign and it was to be vandalised again, you'd be behind square one again, sort you of would, thing. But there are also, uh, for a later YouTube video, anti-graffiti coatings, which are a clear coating. They're impervious to inks, paints, all those types of things. So, if it's something that you're getting done on a regular basis and you're sick of it. Uh, anti-graffiti coating over the top of it, job done. And how can we reach you, John? You can call me on 0427 867 266 or call down here to 127 Norrie Avenue and uh, Grant and I will be having a coffee and talking stuff. Thank you very much, John.